walls there. There they come. There he is. Woo, looky here, looky here for January. <laughs> Good afternoon. Man, what a beautiful day. Not much wind. This, it just says, it just screams crappie fishing all over it. The lake's class slick. Uh, I haven't been in a month or so. Been on the old project over there. And you see that right there, yeah. Been welding and pumping concrete and doing life. But uh, yeah, we're gonna, we'll see if we can't catch some of these old crappie. I'm, I'm not gonna spend a lot of time in places. If, uh, if, if it doesn't look good, I'm gonna hit another one and uh, bounce around and, and if it's just getting skunked then we're going to the deer stand so but the crappie are there i'm gonna stay so we got options we're we're either going to crappie fish or deer hunt or do both or hopefully be successful at one of them but if um i'm telling you if the crappie are biting I, i'm gonna worry about that old deer some other time i'm gonna catch some crappie so let's get hooked up to the boat and get in the water and i'll holler back at you when we get going <laughs> I have a few crappie right here munched up on the side of this creek bank. Caught one little dink out of there. There they are right there. There's a pile of them. I don't know if there's any size to them or not. We're going to find out. fish oh not gonna be a good not gonna be a size team but we got one <laughs> oh my goodness where you been all winter good night okay little guy i mean there is a lot of them right here hope we can get some size and look at all that stuff look at that just look at that Hmm. Looks like there's some bigger fish in this group. Not a keeper, though. Ooh. No, you're not a keeper either. I'm back here. Mm -hmm. A little better fish. Wait. That is a keeper there, boy. Oh, that's a good old fish. That's a good one. Well, we found some crappie now. Oh, that's a heavy sucker, too. He been eating good, boy. He likes 
I think I made it out of here. <laughs> Come on, right. look at that. Look at that. Let's get on. It's, you know, it's exciting now. I found some. That's a 10 inch fish here, boy. Got a creek crappie bag, creek crappie. Got a creek crappie bag, got some teenage fish, lemonade fish. Suckers way good. Mm -mm. <laughs> Ooh -wee. I, I tell you what, this is fun, folks. Good night to the pile of crop in here too. I, if it hadn't been for 903 outdoors and bar fly fishing, I honestly. I don't know if I'd be doing this. I, and I've been watching their videos and I'm catching some creek fish. Now they're using bobbers. I'm not using no bobber. I'm just casting into this herd sitting right here. I don't know what they're looking for. Feed them chef, there's a fish. Oh, yeah. That that's a good fish too. But uh, I, I tell you what, this is something else for sure. <laughs> It'll be Dink, the Dinkster. What are you doing in here, Junior? That's right. Come on, baby, I'm hooked. Okay, go tell your mama. Tell come mama. Tell mama come beat me up. Easy meal. Easy meal. Ooh, that's a good fish. <laughs> Hurry, Bob. I got that one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We got us some fresh slabs. <laughs> we gonna have some fresh fish and fresh calf fries. That's right. That's right. I'm glad I went to go shoot that old deer this week today. I missed out on all this fun. That old deer can wait. These fish can't. Mm. 
Dinkster. The Dinkster. I think I've caught this fish three times now. That's right. Get on. Get on out of here. No. Keep a crappy. Look at there. Woo wee. Them some guns. And they're doing the thing now. I can't believe we caught this old crappie up here in this water. Nine foot of water up here. We did. <laughs> he wanted it. He don't understand what he got a hold of. There we go. Little dink. In case y'all wonder where I get my baits, I get them at 4B Baits in Lake Dallas. They've got a great selection of colors, great price. And they're hardy baits. How many fish we caught off this one bait right here? We let it be a keeper. Keep a crap. Back up, back up, back up. Tap the brakes, back up, turn her in. Look at there. You're not even nine and three quarters, boy. Get in out of here. Look at that crap. That sucker is lit up like a Christmas tree. Mmm, glad we found a spot. Cowboy Collar Crushing got his spot. Muddy Feet's got his spot. Muddy Feet TV, y'all subscribe now. We got a lot of stuff coming up. A lot of stuff. Oh yeah, that's a good fish here. No, it's not. He's a squiggler though, that's why I thought he's a good fish. You see the, the heart that sucker put out? Mm -mm -mm. Come back and see us next year, fella. There you are, he's a good pup. Fish right there. <laughs> oh man. I need you bigger fellas to buy. I got just enough to make a mess, but make it worth them. Worth it making a mess. Hmm? I'm not a hundred percent sure, and I'm not gonna mouth off yet, but I may have found my favorite type of crappie fishing. It's great crappie fishing, it's awesome. At least some bigger fish though. <laughs> I thought that's a better fish than it is. One for the basket. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That's a good one. That's going to be with basket or basket fish. One for the basket. Fixed not to get out of here. Fixed to be too dark. But I feel like we've done a pretty dadgum good job 
of this January Creek crappie fishing. Took, took me a little while to find them, but we found them. <laughs> I had nothing like a good little throw down in January on a crappie. Nothing like a 55 degree day in January. I know some folks is this coming. Matter of fact, some of you folks, when y'all see this video, y'all probably gonna be getting a pretty decent little snowstorm. Ooh, 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 easy. All right, look at there. <laughs> what a fish. We'll take him. He going to the basket. That's a little better fish. That's two in a row, folks. It's gonna be about 11 inches. the leave he sucker biting don't y'all what's there there they come there he is <laughs> I don't know some of y'all that's cheating well you know what you know how many times I've been fishing and I ain't caught a fish or got dinked out or something that's uh -huh. okay. Well, hush up then. All right, by popular demand in the request section of the comments, especially my buddy out in California, you know, I'm talking about full sand. Um, we're gonna do it. We've already caught. We're gonna clean and cook a couple of these crappie. So it's kind of late. I miss supper, so I might as well have a little something, something to snack on. But uh, so yeah, yeah, we're gonna do this. Like I said, we've already caught, clean and cook. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's clean a couple of these crappie and get them ready to fry up, and I'll clean the rest of them, and get them guys ready to. Go in the freezer. Last one, we had 16, not a bad haul for the afternoon, not really knowing what I was going to get into. We're going to run it dry. This is what I do. Use equal parts cornmeal and flour. I'm just gonna use a cup. That'll be plenty for what I'm gonna do here. And then, season it's got a little bit of everything I want heat salt and some flavors is this Louisiana crawfish bowl I do not like this for crawfish or shrimp it's way too salty way too seasony but 
to fry stuff with, it works great. And I, and I don't measure it. I just put a little bit in there, about like that. And I go off the color of my of my flour and my cornmeal. If it, when it starts turning kind of a reddish color, I know we're close. Just a little bit more. Whoop, whoop. That might have been a little, little, little might have been a little heavy there. It may have stumped my, stumped my toe on that deal. That'd be all right though. We got our fillets right here. We're gonna throw them in the bucket. Mix them up real good. Need that. Perfect color. That's pretty. That's pretty. Here we go. We got a little, we're gonna throw a little water burger ketchup in there because we know water burger makes a great product. Hmm. Gotta get it all shook down there to the bottom. Ah. Uh. Okay. Well, then, little Louisiana, little Louisiana hot sauce. Mm, mm, mm. Try this little dude right here. Hot. Oh, it tastes good. My life. That's how it's done, folks. There's your cash cleaning cook. It's delicious. Reminds me how fortunate we are living in a country like we live in. Just remember to respect each other. Things get tough. Don't forget to lock the hubs in. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. <laughs>